This episode of Coronavirus North Carolina News Brief is brought to you by Right By You Mortgage. Wherever life takes you, we're right by you. Visit rightbyumortgage.com slash podcast to learn more. From WRAL News and the Capital Broadcasting Podcast Network, this is your Coronavirus North Carolina News Brief for Friday, October 30th, 2020. I'm Brian Schrader. On Thursday, North Carolina reported the highest number of new cases to date in the pandemic. With just under 2,900 new cases reported, the daily average and that curve we'd been trying to flatten for months hit its highest point yet at just under 2,300. Dr. Cameron Wolf from Duke, infection prevention specialist Jessica Dixon from Wake Med, and Dr. David Wall from UNC all spoke with WRAL about the trends and why they should be taken seriously as we head into the holidays. Folks have been, I know, Uh, under increasing pressure to frankly feel a little bit fatigued and to let their guard down and start gathering again. And and this virus isn't going to be fatigued. This is what happens. Um, We see numbers go back up again. And now we're at a point where it feels like there's no end point. And that's really difficult for all of us. You know, you can run a marathon because you know it's over at 26.2 miles. We're running something like a marathon, except we have no idea how long it is. Unlike some countries where we've seen a real dip, we've never really experienced a valley. We just keep experiencing peaks. Uh, So this is frustrating. And it seems really well correlated with as we relax our protections, we see ourselves with more infections. And I think the writing's on the wall. And it's really just a shame. With Halloween this weekend, there are concerns about adults getting together with friends and family. Infectious disease specialist Jessica Dixon had this advice for people who are planning to celebrate. Don't eat as you go. Keep your hands clean. Gel your hands before you eat anything or wash your hands before you eat anything. Um, You know, I wouldn't have parties. I wouldn't have large gatherings for Halloween because, again, that just increases the danger. If you want to see friends, then certainly be outdoors, be socially distant. Duke University is making changes to its meal distributions on campus. Seating areas and dining halls now are closed and meals are takeout only for students. Earlier this month, WRL Sarah Kruger reported on cases spreading on campus traced back to mealtimes when students often are sitting in closer proximity and not wearing masks. Duke says the takeout will remain in place until further notice. Meanwhile, at least four Wake County schools are dealing with coronavirus cases as they close out the first week of in-person learning. Officials at Alston Ridge Elementary and Kingswood Elementary in Cary, West Millbrook Magnet Middle School in Raleigh, and Cedar Forks Elementary in Morrisville all posted notices about confirmed cases. On Tuesday, Nick Stevens from HighSchoolOT.com reported three coronavirus infections at three Wake County high schools involving their athletic departments. Those schools were Fuquay Verena High School, Heritage High School in Wake Forest, and Panther Creek High School in Cary. And this has been your Coronavirus North Carolina News Brief for Friday, October 30th. Let us know what you think of the podcast. Leave a rating or review wherever you listen, and be sure to subscribe so you don't miss a new episode. I'm Brian Schrader. Thanks for listening. When it comes to buying a new home, you want to know that you're in good hands. At Right By You Mortgage, the dedicated team of lenders live in your community and are committed to being right by you every step of the way. Whether you're a growing family, a relocating professional, or a retiring couple, they'll partner with you to find the right loan to fit your unique home buying needs. Plus, listeners of this podcast will enjoy the Right By You Mortgage on-time closing guarantee. They promise to close on time or they'll pay you and the seller $500. Visit rightbyumortgage.com slash podcast to take advantage of this offer. Wherever life takes you, we're right by you. Go to rightbyumortgage.com slash podcast for full details. Equal housing lender, NMLS number 402136.